What's going on guys, it's Brian with Superman's Comics in collaboration with comicbookinvest.com and in this video I'm gonna give you my weekly picks for new comics that are coming out Wednesday, March 27th, 2019. Great week for comics. We got the big detective issue number 1000 coming out from DC Comics this week. There's some great indie titles coming out as well. I will tell you right up front, I wanted to put the new Spawn book in here, but I'm sick of different covers being changed every week. So Spawn is one of my picks, but it's not in this video because I don't know what cover they're using. Quite frankly, I mean, it switches every week and I'm sick of putting the wrong cover in here. But enough jabby jab jab. Let's head over to the computer and I'll show you my picks. We kick this week off with Batgirl number 33. It's election day in Gotham City and Barbara Gordon's balancing campaigning for a new boss and keeping the peace as a superhero. We have a regular cover by Emanuela Lupacino. There's also a regular price variant by Yasmin Putri. Batman Beyond number 30. We find out if Batman really needs a Robin, or is it time for Neo Gotham's Cape Crusader to fly solo once more? We have a regular cover by Chris Samney. There's also a regular price variant by Ben Oliver. Detective Comics number 1000. We're celebrating 80 years of Detective Comics. It's going to be a 96 page issue. Also, it's going to have the first ever DC Universe appearance of the Deadly Arkham Knight. There's a whole bunch of different covers for it. There's a regular Jim Lee Scott Williams wraparound cover. There's a 1930s Decade Steve Rude cover, 1940s Decade Bruce Timm cover, a 1950s cover by Michael Cho, 1960s Jim Steranko, a 1970s Bernie Wrightson, a 1980s Frank Miller, a 1990s Tim Sale cover, a 2000s Jock cover, a Greg Capullo 2010s variant, a Blank variant, a Jim Lee Midnight release variant, plus a bunch of store exclusive variants that are floating around out there. Flash number 67. Flash returns from his Force quest to Central City, only to find that Central City is now crime free and doesn't need the Flash anymore. There's a regular cover by Rafael Sandoval. There's also a regular priced variant by Ryan Sook. Heroes in Crisis number 7. The Trinity may have uncovered the true killer responsible for the deaths at Sanctuary, but the artificial intelligence that ran the institution is the one thing standing between them and the culprit. We have a regular cover by Clay Mann. There's also a regular priced variant by Ryan Sook. Wonder Woman number 67. How do you fight a giant? You use a bigger giant. Unfortunately for Wonder Woman, the one she knows hates her guts, so how is she going to convince Giganta? to get her to join the fight against the mythological titans that are demolishing Colorado. We have a regular cover by Emanuela Lupacino. There's also a regular price variant by Esteban Moroto. Ice Cream Man number 11. This looks to be a horror parody tale of MTV's old hit show, The Real World. We have a regular cover by Martin Morazzo. There's also a regular price variant by Babs Tarr. Sharky the Bounty Hunter number two. Sharky's chasing a terrorist fugitive with a huge bounty on her head, but they're not the only hunters looking for it, and the competition is thick. There's going to be a regular cover by Simone Bianchi. There's a regular priced sketch cover by Simone Bianchi, and a regular priced Scotty Young variant. Age of X-Men Extremist number two. As Department X continues its work of purging and revising the ill-fitting elements of society, an encounter with a pregnant rebel begins eating away at the team from within. We have a regular cover by Raza. There's also a 1 in 25 incentive variant by Jenny Friesen. I really like this variant. In fact, that is going to be my pick of the week. Amazing Spider-Man number 18. This is part two to Hunted. Craven's plan begins to unfold in Central Park. He lets the prey loose and the hunt begins. We have a regular cover by Humberto Ramos. We have a connecting variant by Lionel Francis Yu at regular price. We have a 1 in 25 incentive variant by Ivron Chavron. There's also a tie-in issue, 18.HU, that's going to have a Greg Land cover. Avengers No Road Home number 7. Spectrum takes command as the Avengers take the fight to the Queen of Night. But whose side is Conan on? We have a regular cover by Yasmin Putri. There's also a regular price variant by Phil Noto. Daredevil number three. I'll tell you, two issues in, and already loving this series by Chip Zdarsky. This is going to have three different covers for it. There's a regular Tedesco cover. There's a regular price now Fuji Cat variant, and an incentive hidden gem variant by John Romita Jr. Marvel Rising number one. Kamala Khan and Dorian Green are going to need some help 
as Jersey is invaded by shiny knights that are driving cars armed with javelins. It's going to have three different covers for it. There's a regular Audrey Mott cover, regular price Ron Lim variant, and an incentive 1 in 25 variant by Peach Momoko. Star Wars Vader Dark Visions number 2. To command an Imperial Destroyer is a coveted position, but with such great responsibility comes grave consequences if you fail your mission. How far will one officer go to spare himself from the judgment of Darth Vader? We have a regular cover by Greg Smallwood. There's also a 1 in 25 incentive variant by Gerardo Sandoval. Superior Spider-Man number 4. With San Francisco and Otto in ruins after Terex's attack, rebuilding's going to be required. But will a weakened Superior Spider-Man be chum in the water to opportunistic villains? We have a regular cover by Travis Cheris. There's also a regular priced variant as well. Sabrina the Teenage Witch number one. This is a new series from Archie Comics, fresh off the hot success of the Netflix show. This has got five different covers for it. There's a regular Veronica Fish cover. There's a regular price Stephanie Buscema variant. Regular price Adam Hughes variant. Regular price Victor Abanez variant. And a regular price Sandra Lands variant. Neon Future number one. This comes from Grammy nominated DJ Steve Aoki. It's about a world that's in grips of economic crisis, and due to mass employment, advanced technology has been outlawed. The world is now divided between those with implanted technology and those without. There's going to be three different covers for it. There's a regular Jeremy Rappack cover. There's a regular price Kim Jong-G variant. And a regular price Jeremy Rackpack variant. Street Fighter Minute number one. This is the first in a new series of Street Fighter one-shots where we meet Minute, the enigmatic Egyptian fortune teller on a quest to avenge her master's death. It's got four different covers for it. There's a regular Panzer cover. There's a regular priced Hanzo Steinbeck variant. There's a regular priced Blank variant. And an incentive Hanzo Steinbeck variant as well. Friendo number five. This is the epic conclusion to this series. I've enjoyed every single issue of it. I'm definitely probably going to pick it up in trade. We've got a regular cover by Martin Simmons and a regular price variant by Kim McLean. Wasted Space number eight. This is one that started out as a mini series but turned into an ongoing, and boy, am I glad it has. This has been a really fun read. In this issue, Dust needs an arm, Billy needs redemption, and only one of these quests is gonna go well. So, there it is, guys. Those are my picks for new comics that are coming out Wednesday. March 27th, 2019. As always, comment down below. Let me know books you guys are picking up, what books you guys are reading. If you enjoyed this video, click that thumbs up button for me. And if you haven't already done so, please consider subscribing. That way you'll never miss a future video. And remember, every Thursday night at 9 p.m. Eastern time, my co-host Jack DeMeo and I are on this channel recapping the week's hottest comic book releases and comicbookinvest.com's Bolo list which is the be on the lookout list that covers first appearances, reader buzz, variant buzz, and that's every Thursday night live on this channel at 9 p.m. Eastern time. This is Brian with Superman's Comics. I'll see you guys next time.